Hello everyone and welcome back to Star Citizen where I'm going to check out Alpha 3.15 in my customary quarterly check-in with the game. This time I'm doing it before the free fly weekend instead of during it so that maybe the servers aren't so busy. Uh, the free fly weekend is coming up on Friday and so if you did want to check out the game at that point you could do so for free for a little bit and they'll probably give you some ships and stuff like that. But I'm here basically to check out how well things are going, mainly for stability and frame rates and all that business. And in this update, they created a medical system and hospitals and a better inventory. And you had to pick your starting location. I've already picked my starting location and loaded it up once. And I picked Lorville. I decided not to pick the Cloud City because it takes too long to get out of it. Uh, so, yeah, I decided to pick the location I thought would be easiest to get out of. I'm not too sure Lorville is the easiest, but you know, that will take some experimentation. It's because of the atmosphere and how long it takes to get out of it. So anyway, I loaded it up, which means that normally when you first load the game, it takes a while for it to get the scenery all in order because it cleared the scenery cache basically. And then subsequent times when you load the game, then it's all right because it still has the cache there. But every time they update the game, it has to, it's really bad on the frame rates. This time it seemed worse than normal. So now this is my second time loading it. And I'm wondering, is it going to be better or is it going to be icky? So basically uh, my first impression was that Alpha 3.15 was worse on the frame rates than the previous version, but we'll see. Maybe it was just having a harder time than usual loading up the scenery initially, and this time it'll be reloading the scenery and we'll see how it does. So best server, we're going for Lorville. Let's see how it goes. I'm sure people would want to know what kind of hardware I have. My CPU is a little bit old. It's an i7-4790K running at four gigahertz. I have 32 gigs of RAM and that's DDR3 RAM, and it is an RTX 2070 video card. So the video card is, uh, I guess, up to snuff. The CPU could be a little bit more up to date, but, you know, serviceable. And it is running off of an SSD. Okay, initial loading time was about a minute and a half to two minutes. And we have optimal nutrition level. So yeah, the first time loading in here, uh, the stuff didn't ju it just wasn't appearing very quickly here, but it looks like, yes, the scenery cache is available. Uh, my OBS is saying that encoding is overloaded, so I'll do the normal thing, which is to separate off the cores. And my CPU is maxed out, so that's the thing. Okay, I've limited star citizen to half of my CPU and OBS to the other half. That will sort of slow Star Citizen down, so it's getting a little bit less frame rate than it ought to with my CPU. But it'll ensure that what you see is what I see as far as OBS recording it. So, alright. Again, I've already sort of preloaded this area, so this is as good as... It gets for me right now with my hardware. As we wake up, the NPCs, I always make note of the weird NPCs. The NPCs in this case aren't looking totally out of place, so that's good. We'll see if there are any standing on couches and that sort of thing. Let's check out external view. I decided to go with a male character this time. Oh, a little bit choppiness there. Well, there's always choppiness on this scene because of all of that business, right? But okay. Definitely better than when I initially loaded in, so... Yeah, it was just a really bad experience on the first load. And now it seems to be smoother, as usual. So, if you do try the free fly thing, uh, keep in mind, just 
like let things sit for a while and then after you've loaded things for the first time reload of, of course uh, I mean and I guess that'll be true every time they update the game but uh, 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 choppiness Okay, Tisa Spaceport. Are they ever going to have a situation where you actually have to do customs interviews? <laughs> that would be painful. Oh, the M50. How I want you. Actually, uh, it seems like I've got more cash on me nowadays. 125,000 they started me out with. But that's a million now. Hangar 9. Okay. Oh, we've got one stray NPC there. Or I guess... Unless it's a player that decided to stand right there. No, but, but I think uh, we've got a stray. I'm gonna call that a stray. Notice the tag for my ship has the hangar number on there. That's handy. Don't remember which version that started happening. And that was a quick elevator ride. That was quicker than I remember them. The ship looking good. Yeah. Look around here. Yep. Best looking spaceships, obviously. I wish I didn't have to get so close to the ramp, because then it tries to skewer me like that. Okay, back in the saddle again. So this is the internal view now. I swear they've changed this a few times too. Mantis Badger Badger, huh? Yeah, I don't even know my weapon systems necessarily. Okay, well, we'll just get permission friends, lower the landing services. Uh, no, no, don't collide, don't collide, don't collide. Uh. Okay, I think we didn't hit anything that time. The rarity. Up we go. So, what do we have now? Knickknacks. You got me. But, apparently, Hurston... Oh, is this a information sort of thing? I can barely read that type. Um, open? Lowerville. Oh, I guess, yeah, as, I guess we gather information about things as we visit stuff, maybe? What is Skyline? I guess that's their name for the map. <laughs> Why do you have to make things so... Trade you can tr you trust. Secure and convenient personal transactions from anywhere to anyone. Oh, I guess that's just between party and friends and that kind of thing. So, we have missions. Salvage claim. Investigation. That's expensive. That's, uh, I mean, not expensive, I mean, valuable. Mining claim, huh? Destroy the orbital sentries and clear the site for Shubin repossession. I guess I might as well try a shooting thing. That way I can die and use the medical stuff. Alright, fine. Hurston L4, huh? Looks like over there. That route? Okay. So... A quantum beacon. Okay, here we go. Regular check on whether quantum jumping works. Okay. Alright, step one was fine. Alright, step two. We'll see how long this particular transfer takes. 
sure hope my guns are good. Okay, uh, it's been about three minutes to get here. Okay, and we've got... Oop, it just went sticky. Okay. Quantum Beacon. Oh, I just pressed T and it went like that. That's... Oh, oh, okay, this is bad. I don't like what's going on there. Okay, things are complicated. That's probably not what I wanted to do. Those are decoys. It seems like I have limited ammo, which I would rather not have limited ammo. Orbital sentries, huh? Doesn't sound so tough. Am I even close to hitting it? Uh, uh, okay. I got, I died. That was quick. Okay. So, now that I've died... <laughs> oh boy. Yeah, well, I certainly haven't gotten Everest Harbor. I haven't gotten the hang of uh, shooting things in here, apparently. I could have sworn that I had better luck with that at some point, but the locking system does not seem to be what it used to be. Okay. All hidden sentries. Man, I didn't even need to find the hidden ones. Ones that were very blatant. Seemed enough. I have been regenerated. Welcome to Kelto Rx Clinic. Alright. F to focus. Probable cause of death. Fatal impact. Well, you could say that. Flight suit and helmet have been placed in my local storage. I guess why? To get up, right? Right? Uh, okay, well, I think I just bumped my head. Okay. So, alright. Local storage? Are you local storage? No, oh, you're not local storage. It's a little bit choppy in here, but I haven't been here before. Well, if I die enough, it uh, it won't have any problems loading in the future. <laughs> no, locker A does not seem to be where my clothes are at. I need my clothes! Protein powder. But yeah, it's choppy right now. Mail is the new thing. It's hand sanitizer, I guess. Uh, authorized personnel only. Well, I don't know if I should go outside like this. Well, I can't click on anything as far as I can tell, so I'll find clothes somewhere. I really don't want them to put me in a psych ward immediately. I guess I could go to a shop. I've got money, in theory. Easy hab. I don't think I can open anything. Okay. Well, good thing the Moby Glass is a very small band. Whoa! Now I have a gown. Okay, I just pressed I for inventory because I didn't see the inventory in Moby Glass. And now I have a, uh, a nifty medical gown kind of thing. And I apparently have places for stuff, but I don't see legs, Arden, core, balefire. I think those that's supposed to be my, I don't know, my suit? It says light armor. Oh, it's loading the icons now. Okay, let's wait. Let's wait until it loads things. We've got undersuit. Uh, we've got a flight suit there. Can I wear it? Well, anyway, it's taking some time to load it all. Oh, there we go. 
All right. Well, we got armor. So equip. No, I can't equip that. Equip? I can't equip it. Grab. Oh, no. No, don't grab. <laughs> no. No. Equip? No. Don't drop. I want it. No, I don't want my undersuit separate. Can I... Oh, okay, I think it's in here. My medical uniform is making me look fat. Um, okay, so... I can't equip. Which... I don't know why. Oh, there's the gown. Medical gown. Swap. Let's try swap. Swap with the undersuit. No? This inventory is not as useful as other inventories I've had in the past. Um, let me just verify. I don't even know where I got the gown from. Equip. Nope. Can't equip it like that. Pico the Penguin Party. Odyssey Helmet. Invictus Flight Jacket. Well, I appreciate having all this stuff. Well, security and the hangars usually go together. Alright, um, vehicle retrieval. This might take a while, though. Okay, well, I can use this anyway. Claim. Well, 47 seconds only. Pad 3. Okay. Five kilometers. We need to go that way more. No, you're missing it. Uh... I, I just, this approach to it does not make much sense, to be honest. How are we still getting closer when we were... Yeah, I don't understand our approach vector at all. It's gone all the way around us. Curious. Oh, right. Um, we need to get in there real quick. Oh no! Oh no! Well... Oh, this isn't a space. This isn't. Uh, no, no, I need to. No! I died. No, I don't need to have a rescue beacon. Uh, hold back space to die. Well, I'll just die. Okay, yes, I've died. Okay. Now, in the hospital room, I'm going to go to the hospital room, right? New Babbage? Wait! Totally different place. I thought I was... I guess... What? <laughs> I thought I was supposed to respawn in the same place each time. I guess it's whoever picks me up. I mean, it's literally in the, that Everest Harbor place. Well, looks the same anyway. Okay, so... Now, in inventory, right, can I equip things? Undersuit, beacon, beacon, undersuit. I like this flight suit better. I still can't equip it. The medical gown isn't actually... Okay. Oh, I guess maybe I can just drop on. Oh, it's just a drag and drop thing. Okay. Well then, but why can't we just say equip? Okay, looking good. Um, that'll help. Odyssey 2 helmet alpha. We've got a horizon helmet. Balefire, okay. All right. Yeah, this is not the head I picked. 
Which is weird. Okay, uh, I don't think... That helmet is not appearing. <laughs> okay, I put a helmet on and it's not appearing. I guess maybe it's gonna take some time to decide to appear. Yep, I did not get the head that I was expecting. Oh, that's not a good helmet. Okay, this other Balefire stuff... Work at all? Oh, that, that that can be placed on top of it. All right. We can get all armored here. I guess this goes on the back. Yep. Okay. Dual wielding. Can we? No. One gun at a time. Ah, no luck on the jacket. I don't need all the armor right now, though. Let me see if I can make uh, wear the jacket on top of the undersuit. It is an undersuit. I can put a jacket on right now. I guess not. And without the armor, it seems to have taken the gun away, too. Not sure, though. I think the helmet only works if we've got the rest of the suit. Something like that. Okay, well, that's something discovered. Sentries destroyed, zero out of nine. Yeah, that might be difficult. Yeah, I don't, I don't think that I'm going to be able to fulfill that contract very well. Went out in my underwear last time, or in a hospital smock. There's gonna be mayhem in this game, folks. <laughs> I guess I don't have to go through the back. It's got a little marker here. I think, I don't know which version they added these markers for where we can enter the ship. But that's handy too. Okay. Flight ready. Badgers. How do I use these badgers? Oh, it's refueled too. That's a lot of things it's in use for, but yeah, let's just fire all the weapons on button one. Okay. Well, now that I know all that business. Okay, the Badgers are energy weapons. The Mantis is not, apparently. Okay. Ignite. So that's our missile. Here we go again. I'll try one more time. I have a bad feeling about this. Uh, I hear things shooting at me, but I can't figure out how to target them. See, that's... Okay, fine. I guess we won't be targeting them. Uh Yeah, okay. I I don't know what I'm doing with the combat anymore. That then now I'm on Lorville. I'm at Lorville this time. Well, okay. I think I'll leave it here as I wake up in Lorville once again. Yeah, I was under the impression that I 
Just pressing the target nearest enemy button and I was not targeting my nearest enemy. Yeah, oh, I'm. it seems to need to reload the stuff in my inventory again. So that's inconvenient. Guess I might have to wait around for that. But yeah, so that is my initial check of Alpha 3.15. It's doable, I just need to figure out how to do combat now. So, that seems trickier than I remember it being. But, I'll work on that and see how that goes. For now, thank you for watching, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please do press like. If you have any comments or suggestions, please leave them in the comment section below. And I'll see you next time.